Oh gosh, what is that? Something in here. Something in here with us. What is it? Show yourself. Oh, ah! What the heck is this thing? Oh, you little thief. And so, Paulina Punchwood, the heroine of our story, mother of dinos, friend of the apes, slayer of zombies. Oh, wait, wrong game. Uh, but generally all around, dynamite gal. Whoops. <laughs> Was back. Yay, Paulina Punchwood is back in Ark. And a new map just came out called the the Guero, the Guero, something like that. It's a, a free DLC. Oh, look at that! Level up. We picked up a rock, and now we're gonna put on some weight, Paulina. And let's go ahead and we gotta make a spear. Learn how to make a spear anyway, because we need some we need some defense. Um, yeah. So we're back. This just came out. The new uh, the new DLC. It's a free download arc so that's always nice if it's free it's for me we need flint and we need wood we pretty much need everything don't we thatch and wood to make the pickaxe and then we can get the flint from the stones it's all coming back to me now so yeah it's been a really long time since i've played any arc and i've always enjoyed this game it's kind of a love hate relationship right because it's one of those games that requires a ton of time to make any progress it's very, very challenging. Staying alive is tough. And if you die, you tend to lose a lot of stuff. <laughs> um, sometimes the dinosaurs don't listen to you when you tell them what to do. And there were all kinds of weird bugs and things happening. What is that guy? Uh, I think he's high. I don't know. He's coming this way, though. Um, friendly? I don't know what the heck that thing is. I've never seen that before. Well, let's go ahead and add weight. Always add the weight first so we can carry more of the stuff we want to carry around. And we still got to get our thatch and wood. We get that from uh, trees. That Oh, gosh. we got to stay away from the big bird. Big bird. Get away from the big bird. Big bird bad. So let's, let's run over here. Yes, that RG will tear us apart. So I started on... Uh, there was many, many places to choose from. I, I chose beach. Beach one on this new map. So we're somewhere near a beach. It's a relatively new Navy type zone, I suppose. I don't know. We're going to find out. Although having an RG right there is not a good sign. And we got these mountains. I saw snowy mountains right close to. So I don't know how tough this start is going to be. But we'll do our best. We shall do our best. So this map, again, just came out. It has a whole new dinosaur, a Deinonychus, which is some kind of big ostrichy thing. Um, I don't. I think they're pretty aggressive, so hopefully we don't run into one of those too soon. As far as I know, you cannot tame them, but you can steal one of their eggs and um, you can raise a, a young one. Uh, excuse me. All right, you know, when nature calls, what you gonna do? Let's make an ax. I'm gonna make a couple of spears. I better get some more flint. And now we can go get some wood and more thatch with our tools. Much better than punching the wood. Only in a punch wood doesn't mind punching wood so much, but it is more efficient to use the proper tool for the job, as we know. All right, uh, I guess we're done there. Here's some wood over here. Let's go grab some wood. Make sure the coast is clear. <laughs> Wood and thatch. Of course, now I've got to remember what gets what because the tools here work a little weirdly. Uh, let's have a look around. I want to see like a beachy area. This is very rocky. Um, where's a nice beachy? Well, I'm in the water. I did not want to do that. It is cold and scary and dangerous, but it's worth a level up. Worth a level up. So I, I do always increase the. Um, the multiplier for uh, for leveling up just because I don't like wasting time and this game is a grind as it is so it's nice to crank up some of the levels if you guys are interested in what levels I have I'll try to remember to put them down in the description let's make I'm gonna make at least three or four spears oh we can make some clothes now too let's get some pants on the poor girl and how about a head covering we need lots of fibers for this kind of stuff. Yeah, the spears break very easily. Plus, you can throw them, so it's always good to have multiples. 
every little thing. Oh, ah, hi! That's a Gallimimus. Friendly, right? Galley. It's a pretty one. Pretty Gallimimus. I gotta remember all my dinosaurs again, because I don't remember what they do and what they don't do. There's a nice beach over there. Let's head over to the beach. Okay, this looks like a relatively friendly place. I see a lot of passive dinosaurs. Nothing too big and nasty. Although even the small ones can be nasty. <laughs> Alright, let's get some clothes on. Uh, probably in here. Double click. Seems to work. And how about if we use one of our... Um, we got some weird skins here. Let's put that there. There we go. We got our glasses on. It's sunny here. Let's see, how's that look? Oh, yeah. Looks great. Keep that sun out of the eyes. How are we doing for wood and thatch and everything? Because we're going to start making... We're going to start making a little home. We're going to get skins. Ha ah, ah. You never know what's going to come out of this wood. But that's just a chicken. Die. Early, primitive chicken. But careful now, because they might... They, they, they come in numbers. All right, we got some hides. Woohoo! Now we can make some shoes. Paulina, but I want to go check this thing out. Oh, it's a big dolphin thing. <gasps> is it dead? Yeah, it's dead. Oh, it's spoiled. It's got hides and organic polymer. Oh, this thing is amazing. But why is it dead on the beach? Is this like something for the, with this map? Yeah, this is a... Well, it's a creature that lives and you can tame them. Oh, turtle. Um, but this one... Gly! <sighs> Gosh darn. Give me a heart attack. <laughs> When you hear those footsteps so fast like that, I always feel like something's coming right at me to kill me. Oh my gosh. This place is, is so tense here. It's really scary. There's somebody with a, a headache or angry up there. Someone's triggered. That must be one of them alphas, I think, right? Is that what that is? Glowy guy. I'm going to make a sleeping bag and some walls and a door. And probably... Oh, can't learn the storage box yet. All right, but what can we make right now? We can make the shoes with the hide, and a water skin is nice, but it's not completely necessary right now. Oh, we need the uh, arm coverings. All right. So this guy, like, he's got a ton of hides, right, and spoiled meat. So we're just getting a lot of spoiled meat and organic polymer. Ah, oh, what's that? <sighs> Don't do that, Timmy Turtle. Don't you do that. I wonder if we can tame a turtle. I think we gotta knock him out. So that's not gonna happen for a while. Oh, there's a dead turtle here too? Are you kidding me? Yeah, he's dead all right. Wow. So I wonder if these are planted here to give us um, like some of these these uh, resources that are kind of hard to find at first, like keratin and hides. Well, hides not so much, but boy, we're getting a lot of hides from this guy. We're also getting a ton of spoiled meat, which would be great if we could make some of the, um, uh, what's that stuff you make that knocks out the, the dinosaurs? A tranquilizer, right? You can make tranks with this stuff, narco, and the spoiled stuff. So I wonder how long these little critters will stick around, but it seems like they're planted here for us to get a, a bit of a start. That's kind of cool, I guess, but my, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that they'll disappear pretty soon. All right, we're going to start making some sheltery things, and we got to get some food going. Can we get across here? No, dying of cold or getting eaten. Oh, man. Our swimming is so slow. <laughs> I think we could probably... Oh, what's in there? <sighs> this is a chicken. Prehistoric chicken. Kill it. Get him. He's in there. Get, get. Oh, got him. All right, good chicken meat. Let's get him. Get that meat. I forget what gets meat. I think it's the pickaxe, actually. There's a big rock right here. Oh, gosh. What is that? Something in here. Something in here with us. What is it? Show yourself. Oh, ah! What the heck is this thing? Oh, you little thief. All right, let's grab some water. Oh, no, that's food. Oh no! Yeah, we gotta eat. Let's uh, let's get a fire on the beach. We did actually put this thing. Oh, that's so cool! I love a fire on the beach. And we're gonna split up. So oh, we only have eleven wood. Okay, look at that there. Throw some meat on the bobby and cook it up. Some more meat here. All right. So now we can get some real protein and sustenance. All right, we got one meat. Let's go ahead and eat it. 
Alright, one meat down the hatch, because Pony is getting super hungry out here, chopping all this wood and fighting all the nasties. And that'll keep us nice and warm when the sun goes down, because it does get chilly here. Is there something else in here? I thought this island was safe. This little island. Apparently it is not. Let's get a shelter whipped up here. So we can at least put down our sleeping bag. It's not going to be a big place, but it will be enough to get started. That looks good. And whip up another one. Uh, we should probably do... Two by two. All right, let's do a two by two. We should have enough resources. It's going to be a little square for now. Oh, leveled up. Sweet. Just going to keep cranking up the weight. And how are we doing over here for for um, Engram's? Oh, the bola. Yeah, the bola can be very, very good. Even for stopping, like, raptors and stuff that come at us. We can wrap them up and then run away. <laughs> and a slingshot. Whoa, what's that? Oh, okay, those guys, as nasty as they look. Hi, yeah, I'm talking about you, buddy. As nasty and mean as they look, they're not. Actually, very passive. They're nice. Nice dinosaurs. Vegematarians, I believe. All right, let's put that down. And let's grab some more resources. Uh, I'm trying to get rid of this bush, but I can't. Gone? All right, it's gone. You gotta find the roots. You gotta pull up the roots. Oh, look at that. It's getting cold already. All right, let's make up some walls. Uh, we're gonna need a door and then one, two. Oh. All right, we are out of resources. Let's go get a thatch. I'm gonna need a thatch. What should we get from trees with our little pickaxe here? Wow. Oh, don't hit that guy. If we hit him, he might fight back. Although, I, you know what? The, what are they called again? My chops? Oh, hi. Put giant bee honey in the last item to feed. Oh, yeah, we can tame those guys. Maybe we'll do that eventually. Honey, huh? I think that's something new. I don't remember honey. Okay, let's put a door over by the front. Yeah, right there. And we'll put up some walls. Now, this is not going to keep us very safe. Um, raptors can tear right through it. I'm not sure about the little guys, but I know some of the larger dinosaurs can rip right through the thatch. So we're going to have to upgrade it to um, to a wood shelter soon enough. And we're going to need some... Is that ceiling? Yeah. And some ceilings. You know, it seems like the building... Oh, we didn't put my arm wrappers on. There we go. Fully armored. Check her out. Oh yeah. Looking good. It's been a long time, Paulina. Mother of dinos. It seems like the building is easier. Like the, the requirements for the actual uh, pieces here seems to have been lowered. I don't think I... Ch I did not change that. I think that just seems like it's part of the... Maybe the game has changed that. I only changed the actual resource gathering and the experience and the number of stuff you get from harvesting. And again, the taming. I think that's it. We got all the walls. Not a bad little place, huh? It's pretty cozy. And we're gonna grab some more of that meat. Still cooking up. Oh, is that my chop still out there? My chops. Isn't that a Pokemon? Let's put our bed down. That gives us a respawn place. Woohoo! And can we make a crate? Make a crate. We can dump some of the stuff out. Oh, there goes the fire. Now it is getting cold. I mean, I did make a door, right? Yeah, we did. Put up a door, and we're going to need ceiling. Um, I may hold off on the ceiling. I may go up another level. I don't know about that yet. Um, let's put a little foot locker down. Right there. We can start transferring stuff over, like the polymer. Oh, no, it's going bad. Oh, there's aberrant dinosaurs on this map, too. I guess the, it's pretty... It's got a lot of variety. So, I think all, pretty much all the dinosaurs are represented. And there's the one new one, the Deinonychus. Dude, you really want me to tame you, don't you? Uh, hey, that's not very nice. Look at him looking back at us, you dirty girl. Sassy, I like you. We're going to find you some giant bee honey, okay? 
wherever that is, and pick up your mess. Let's get inside and get a little fire started. And we can put that, uh, we'll put it in a corner somewhere. Put it in this corner for now. Open it up and dump in some wood. Light it. It's getting chilly without the roof. Yeah, that is one reason we probably should build a roof. It's going to be super low, though. I mean, it's only thatch, and it's easy to make. So. Wow. Heard that. Yeah, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Oh, <laughs> no. All right, whip up the final piece to our roof. PKA ceiling, and excuse me. And man, this girl is so regular. It's all that fiber. Is she eating fiber? I don't know. All right. That looks great. Close the door. And, oh yeah, it's cozy in here. So cozy warm now. There's no more uh, snowflake showing, so I'm assuming that means we're good to go. Good to go by the fire. And it's a little, the ceiling's a little low. I will play around with that later. But again, let me know if you guys want to see more. Leave a like on the video. So who can we tame? Who would be our first tame here? I don't know where to get honey, so it doesn't look like we're gonna be able to tame this guy anytime soon. Um, I don't know, maybe there's a bunch of um, little friendly guys around here. What is that? Is that a Carnotaur? Is it a turtle? Go that way. That's a dang Carnotaur right there. I thought this was a safe place. Oh my gosh, if he chases something over here, it's curtains. The Carnotaur will chew right through this thatch. You might even be able to chew through wood. I'm not sure about that. So this place isn't all that safe after all. How do we make uh, defenses? Can we make defenses yet? No, we can't. We can't make the spiked defenses yet. This right here, this the spiked wall. But that'll probably come very soon. We can we can do that next time. I do want to play more of this. So I hope you guys are enjoying it. And I think we're gonna call it quits here in a moment. Let me just grab a few things. Ah! Heard that! <laughs> I think that's just my chops. Oh! What is that? Is that thing dead? Uh, no. I don't think that's dead. That looks like one of them giant uh, crawdads or something. I think they're dangerous. Although it looks. Is it dead? Oh man. So close to my secure island. I think it might be dead because it looks like it's not moving. Throw a spear at it? Throw a spear at it. <laughs> ah, it's dead. It's totally dead. Did I hit it with the spear? Yeah, I hit it with the spear. Okay, it's dead. <laughs> okay, it's dead. Oh, it's a manta ray. Oh, I thought it was an insect. I saw it like the little um, antenna. Okay, well, let's, let's get him. Which we got? Oh, we got fish meat! Oh, fish meat good. Fish meat real good. Tasty and I think um, super filling. Oh, lovely. Let's cook up some fish meat. Yeah, I wasn't sure if that thing was alive or dead or what it was. Oh, look at that meat. Right, yeah. We're gonna have fish on the barbie tonight. In fact, let's have our first piece of fish. Paulina loves seafood. Go ahead and have some. Mmm. So good. And another piece. Oh, yeah. Grilled manta ray on the beach here in Villagro. Or whatever it is. <laughs> okay. I think we're going to call it quits right here for this episode, folks. I hope you enjoyed. And I'm going to head back inside now. And uh, Paulina's going to go to bed. So we'll just wait out the night right here where it's nice and cozy warm. And we'll say goodbye. Let's see. Do I have an emote set up? Oh, yeah, I do. Goodbye. We'll see you guys next time. Hope you enjoyed. And don't forget to leave a like on the video. And we shall continue another time. No? What do you mean no? Yeah. Yes. Right. Okay. I think that means yes. <laughs> oh, you tease. I don't know what she's saying. It's all mixed messages with Paulina. <laughs> Alright, that's it for now. See you next time. Have a good day. Is that just my chops out there? I hope so. Oh boy. So scary here. <laughs> <laughs>